Many houses in Brownsville are decorated with red and green in December. But in late January, it's black and gold, and that means the Steelers are going to the Super Bowl. I'm truly excited about the Steelers having made the Super Bowl this year. It's kind of unexpected because of the tough schedule they had and the number of injuries that they had to overcome. Um, especially players like uh, Willie Parker who we probably would have gone undefeated if he wouldn't have been injured and, and had his running ability as he did last year. My favorite player is, is probably a hard selection. Troy Palomalo is definitely at the top of the list especially after that interception he made in that San Diego game and uh, you can't say enough about James Harrison. I mean like he's the the uh, center of that whole uh, defense. Students at the high school are excited about the Super Bowl. Good morning students and staff. Today is Friday, January 23rd, 2009. Please rise for the Pledge to the Flag, followed by a moment of silence. I, I am crazy about the Steelers. I love the Steelers. Um, Bill Cowher, I wish he was still the coach, but this is going to be crazy. Uh, the Super Bowl, Cardinals, Steelers, I love the Steelers. We got the best defense around. We are going to get so many touchdowns, we are going to crush the Cardinals. Yeah! The students and the teachers at Coxton Hay Elementary love the Steelers. My favorite player is Troy Paul Malu because he can intercept anything they throw and uh, the score for the Steelers and Cardinals would probably be 22-14 and the Steelers will probably win and uh, I like the Steelers because they are a good team together and they can mostly do anything so they can do good defense and good offense. Uh, welcome to Steeler World. My favorite Steeler player now, currently, is right behind me, Troy Paul Mullo. My all-time favorite is Terry Bradshaw. Uh, Steelers will win the Super Bowl this week. We will get our six-pack because my boy Troy is taking us there. Who better than number 43 and his big interception to take us to Super Bowl 43. So, here we go, Steelers. Here we go. I do work my Pittsburgh Steelers into my social studies classes. Last week it was a social studies science lesson because we had the Steelers on the board, the Eagles, the Ravens, and the Cardinals. None of those three birds could break through steel. And we proved it. And now we're going to prove it again when we beat the Cardinals. We also found out um, people in my class that have relatives all across the country and they all have a Steeler bar or a Steeler restaurant in their area. There are Steeler fans everywhere. I've been to Phoenix to a Steeler bar, to Fort Lauderdale, Florida. They're even in Cleveland, Ohio. <laughs> go Steelers, good luck, and I'm anxious to go to that parade in Pittsburgh no matter how cold it is. <laughs> 